Hello everyone, as Thanksgiving week starts, first I want to let you know that I was on Linda G's channel earlier today. If you want to see that session, go and check it out on her channel. This Thanksgiving day on Thursday will feature a Leo moon, which in broad terms is a very good moon for a celebratory day. Since no sign parties like Leo and this moon sign, it's much more likely than not to reflect happy moods and cheery vibes. In addition, the moon cycle puts it in a trine to the sun in Sagittarius, which also contributes to an air of harmony. Nevertheless, some caution is advised because there are multiple planets in fixed signs, thereby creating a fixed grand cross in the sky. And as soon as you see that Saturn, Uranus, and Mars are part of the mix, you can anticipate that in some households, the conversation and the vibe might just get a little or a lot contentious. We are, after all, traversing a period of national division that is often not just restricted to red and blue states, but can manifest itself on the familial level as well. Planets in Leo and Aquarius opposing each other can lead to discussions about the value of the individual versus the needs of society, and Taurus the Scorpio is personal money, versus collective money. You can probably guess where these polarities fit in the political discussion and the kind of discord that could arise. I'll be away the rest of this week and back on Sunday for the next Patreon astrology class. But meanwhile, I've set up the channel to post some video replays, one from 2020 and the rest from earlier this year. The reason I chose these videos is either to illustrate interesting and important astrology in action or else because they deal with legal or political situations that are currently relevant. I hope everyone has a great Thanksgiving and may yours be in a family where love and harmony rule the day.